I can't believe we've just done that. We want to get some stuff for the house. And some new clothes. And some new clothes. Helen's favourite shop. Yes. We're going to go and try and find some wedding rings, yeah? They fit you like a dream. Ellen's got a football match and she she's striker. And she thought, you know what? I'll get these bad boys. <laughs> You're not gonna go to prison. <laughs> I'll lose my job. <laughs> oh my god. I'm exposing you. Welcome back to our channel. It's been a while since we've actually vlogged. It's been like two weeks. But we've been busy, haven't we? Yeah. We've had your birthday. Busy with work, both of us. Sickness bugs, colds. We've both been ill. I had food poisoning. So we haven't had the time to like properly vlog, but we've got some time now. We got an exciting video for you today. Viewing the wedding venue, we are going shopping. In hopefully Birmingham. in Birmingham, yeah. Hopefully get some home decor. Is that how you say it? Decor. 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 <laughs> Decor. Hopefully get some home items for <laughs> the house because it's coming into spring slash winter. No. Oh autumn, my lord. Autumn. What is going on? Coming into autumn winter now and we fancy just getting some new bits for the house. We also need some clothes because we threw out a load of our clothes we and did. now we realise that we've got zero outfits. I'm wearing the last summery outfit of the season which I actually hate now that I've got it on, this striped Why? top. I just don't like stripes, really. Also, I've got to give a quick shout out to these guys, Filippo Loretti, who sent me this very nice watch. So they gifted this and they also said that if you want to pick one up, you can use Fabian15 on their website, get a little discount. But and if you don't know how to spell that, it's F-A-B-I-E-N. But I didn't have a watch before this um, because I was wearing a Fitbit, but I broke that skateboard in and I wanted a nice watch. So thank you for sending me this out. What is it you want to show? A new bathroom accessories. By the way, we cleaned the whole house last night. Best thing ever, because we woke up this morning and the house was nice and tidy. Yeah, it's nice to wake up to a tidy house. Anyway, look at these. How snazzy are those? They are very clean. I love the, br is it brass? Brass yeah. tops. Yeah. Body wash, and shampoo, And labels, and also, because I was a bit like, oh, they've got labels on them, but they're, they're waterproof. Anyway, they're from the label mummy on Instagram and she very kindly gifted those to us. We were very impressed with them, aren't we? Yeah, it's way cleaner because we used to have like yellow, orange, green bottles, <laughs> every brand of conditioner possible. Yeah. So now it's a lot cleaner just yeah. like that. Yeah. Right, we need to get going because we've got a 45 minute drive now, haven't we? Mm -hmm. we Who's also driving, by the way? Oh, it's a bloody mess. It is. It's, your, it's, it's all like your food. A... Is anyone else as bad as we are at constantly losing your wallet and purse? Phone and bag. And phone. And we need to get those Apple Air tags. Genuine you know where life. you can just literally ping it and see where it is? Like a key ring that tells you where it is. Because it's when you lose something, you're like, I wish I had the superpower to ring it. Find out where it is. Yeah. So we need to do, we need to do something about Maybe that. Maybe we now. just need to get a bit better at remembering where we put stuff. Yeah, but how do you do? Is that? Can you even do that? Yes, you just always put your stuff where where it's meant In to the go. Same anyway, place. we're going to be late. <clears throat> okay. How long is this drive? How long till we arrive? Twenty minutes. Double fuck. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> doesn't Elle's hair look nice? Look, she's had her hair extensions refitted. So. Yep. Refitted and I said it before and I'll say it again. Chloe is really good at what she does. I honestly cannot feel my extensions at all in my hair. So basically, if you have the tape extensions, you get them fitted and obviously have to pay for the hair and then the fitting. And then every like eight to 10 weeks, I think it is, you're supposed to have them redone because they basically grow with your natural hair. My hair grew, so I had to go in a week earlier for seven weeks. My hair had grown like that much. And then now she's put them all back in. My hair, she was saying that my hair looks really healthy. Do we need to take anything with us, by the way, to this? Yeah, Fab. What? Don't worry, darling. I have got it all sorted here. See, good. aren't you good? Well, that's why I'm with you, Al, all right? Because... God forbid anything ever happened to me. Well, yeah, God forbid. How would God you organize forbid. your life? Get a, get a You'd have PA. to get a PA. Last minute, as always. Wow, right, right, here you go. Where, where? You got a sign there? Yeah. Quick. There, and print your name. This is what she made me do Come as on. well. This is what she made me do when 
when I proposed to her. Yeah, you haven't finished yet. Another one? Have you read through this? Yes. You ready? I wish we could. We're fine. We're, we're, we're not even late. We've got one minute to spare, Ellen. Don't you worry, your little boots. Okay? Beautiful surroundings. Yeah, what a view. I can't believe we've just done that. We booked it. Are we gonna put, we are we gonna put the are we gonna put the footage of the place in this vlog or should we wait put it in, a put it in the vlog? wedding series? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, you're gonna have to wait to see the venue that we've booked, but oh my it god, we just, love it. It is so beautiful. Oh, yeah. I cried. I cried yeah. when I walked into where we get married. Yeah. I I was crying. You I just did... had that feeling as soon as we walked through the doors, yeah. it was like, you know, don't you? Yeah. And it helped that Liv, who is Ellen's friend, was the wedding coordinator or wedding yeah. manager there. So yeah. and she we did just such felt a good way more at ease. Doing, like showing, showing us around. around, and it was just nice that I knew. Mm. So you could just, you just didn't feel bad about asking questions. Wow. <laughs> that's, that's, a, that's good. We're getting married. We're getting married. We're getting married. Bye bye. Right. Right, should we go to Birmingham now? Yeah. Yeah? I bet it's a trek from here, isn't it? How, see how long it is. Oh, he put his head in. <laughs> oh. So, the plan today is we want to get some stuff for the house. And some new clothes. And some new clothes. Um, and then we're meeting, we're going for a meal later at Wagamama's with some friends. Wow. They are very different. Helen's favourite shop. Anything you're after? Oh, you got a dodgy basket. I like it. Yeah? Yeah, it looks cool. This is Helen's problem. Yes. Does it look a bit like nanny? I quite like it too. That colour will go, won't it? Yeah, because it's got like a little bit of pink in it. These are the pillows we decided to go with instead. Yes. I'd actually wear that normally. Is it like cotton granite? Very nice. I might get that. That's bags. Quick bag drop off. We've got half an hour to kill before food, so we think we're gonna go and try and find some wedding rings, yeah? We're gonna have a look, can't we? Yeah, probably not buy, but have, well, definitely not buy, but have a look. I've also done an outfit change into my new shirt. It doesn't look nice. I don't, I'm not so sure on it, but. He doesn't think he likes his new shirt, but I really like it. You need to wear more stuff like that. Do you reckon? Definitely. I'm starving, by the way. I know, I I'm know, flagging I now. But it's good so far, isn't it? It's just so busy. Yeah. It's unbelievably busy. Which is a bit overwhelming, bit overwhelming, yeah. But it's nice to be out shopping. got the weirdest sneeze ever and she can't control it and it's hilarious. It's gone now. It's, it's gone. I'm gonna catch it on, yeah. on film one day because it is hilarious. <laughs> she has like a, a fit. She goes like <laughs> <laughs> It's like it gets stuck. Yeah. And then it's like <laughs> <laughs> Are you feeling a bit rough? A little bit rough, yeah. And we're home. Whoops. So this is the new shirt I bought, first of all. May as well show you this, because I got it on. Still not 100%. Actually, it's all right. I'm just, you know what? I, I'm not used to wearing color. Do you like it? It's from Zara. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Uh-huh, uh-huh. 
assignment. Yeah. Uh, what are we doing then? Showing them what we got. I just want to try it on. <laughs> Did I just get banned? Yeah, you did. Yeah, you did. Oh, 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 so it's, like, it's getting a little bit dark, I'm so impressed. should we turn the light on? No, it's fine. So these are the cushions that we bought. Mm -hmm. Two of these puppies. From Primark. Boom, we needed, look, let's show them up close. Ugh. I'm actually really surprised with the quality of these from Primark. They had Ten loads pounds. of cushions. Tenor, tenor a pop. Um, but we needed these for the spare so the sofa bad. bed. They fit you like a dream. Yes. Loving them. Are they Primark? No. They're not too long on you either. You might have to fold them up once. Why have they got lines on them? Where? You see? Oh yeah, they got lines. I'm not sure. Where are they from? H&M. H&M. Next up, we've got Snow White and the one tracksuit. I don't think I like this. Mm, me neither. Oh, I like that. That is sick. Sick. Yes, that actually looks really good on you. Joggers are a little bit long, but you could pull them up. The only thing is, I think you can tell that they're men's joggers with the fit. You just want them, that's probably, that's what it is. <laughs> um, no, I don't, but... You should have got one, because we then we could have been matching. Let's see a twirl then. I love the design. It looks high-end. It looks like something you'd buy from, like, a streetwear brand. Next. Is that a keep or a get rid? This is definite keep. Both? If you would like to borrow my joggers, then you can borrow them. Okay. I do like that. I think the collar is a touch too big. <laughs> what do you think? I like it. It's different. Yeah. And I love that colour. Is it comfy? Very comfy. Yes, now I'm here for this. Love the cap. Leave a comment down below, guys. Doesn't she look great in a cap? She always hates the way she looks in caps. A little bit like a Domino's delivery driver. <laughs> but, no, I'm joking. I think that I think caps really suit. a little bit more like this. Really? <laughs> no, that look, oh, trust me, that looks cool. Do you feel confident wearing a cap or not? I just feel a bit like an idiot. Why? Well, my hair's not been done, so... I've got this scarf. Lovely. Let's see it then. You putting it on or not? No. Okay. And these shoes. Now, I'm not gonna lie, these look like an Irish, like an Irish leprechaun <laughs> shoes, <laughs> I think. Are you playing? <laughs> <laughs> these are actually, you have to have these shoes to be able to go to leprechaun training school. They also look like <laughs> someone who's going to start on me on a night out would be wearing those shoes. What are they for? Work? Work. Are you planning on kicking someone's head out? <laughs> Since when did hooligans wear smart shoes? The buckles for extra, <laughs> extra boot. Either that or you're toe punting a football. You've got a football <laughs> match, haven't you? Ellen's got a football match and she she's striker. And she thought, you know what? I'll get these bad boys. They're called the shit flicker 900s. <laughs> look at this, quick break from the fashion show. For a lovely, you can't really see it, but sun is setting. It's been a beautiful day today and the light is just insane. We are feeling very grateful to live where we live today. We started the day off looking out of the window and we're ending it here. What a beautiful view. I'm actually looking forward to the sunsets that we get in in like autumn, winter, because you can actually see them rather than having to be up at bloody half nine, ten o'clock. <laughs> Come on, you're taking your bloody long. Yeah, because you're filled with toes. <laughs> First items are from Primark. They did this called Earth Colours, which is like a natural collection. They're it says recycled collection. this product was dyed with Acaroma East Colours, a dye stuff made from food byproduct and plant waste. So nice and ethical. So basically pa plant poo. Basically I'm putting plant poo track. <laughs> Shall I turn it off recording or? Huh? No, entertain them. Oh. 
What were you doing? <laughs> you said entertain them, so I did. <laughs> what do you think? I actually love that. Do you? Oh, yeah. What? Those joggers are nice, fat. Do you reckon? Really nice. See what I mean, though? Look, they sag on the arse. I'm not yeah, so sure about I that. I like that. Do you? They are comfy. Yeah. Nice. It's a nice colour as well. <laughs> Whoops, I almost fell over. Second quick item is another pair of joggers from... Look, do you have to come so close? <laughs> Sorry. A pair of joggers from H&M, just simple grey joggers. Because I needed some more... I needed stuff to skate in because I kept ripping jeans and cargo trousers. So joggers it is. Final item from Zara. Oh, these yeah, green nice. cargo trousers. No, they're not cargo, are they? They're like... Chinos. Mm. Like jogger chinos. They're nice though. They're a nice length on you, aren't yeah, they? Yeah, nice colour too. I'm wondering how tall Fab is. He's six foot four. No, six three. Six foot three. About 100 kilos. Five foot. 57 kilos how many wins 700 wins zero hours <laughs> show us your hook show us your one two oh uppercut left hook oh okay i believe you um that's what we bought today it was nice to do a bit of retail therapy although birmingham was weird birmingham was weird there was this is what you don't see ladies and gentlemen and i'm rarely I when just, I ask her to film... No, crap, I was just flicking the bees. <laughs> <laughs> You're not going to go to prison. <laughs> I'll lose my job. <laughs> I'm going to lose my job. It's Monday. It's my lunch break. Let's have a look and see what these pedos look like, shall we? Let's move this crap out of the way. Duvets galore. So... Which way does, does the pattern go? Yes. Do we need to match the pattern? Maybe they can go like back to back. That is put on oh, me. You can't tell me they don't look good on there. They were made for that sofa bed. Happy with that. Do we need a little one in the middle? Or is that going to be overkill? I think that probably uh, just about does it at the moment. Elle's at work. I'm also at work, but on my lunch break. Gonna be going to the gym later for the first time in about 10 days. Had a complete break just because of being so busy and being ill and stuff, so I'm excited to get back to that. It's a bloody gorgeous day today in the UK. We're coming into autumn. The weather is not usually this nice, like this late in September, but it's sticking around, so. I have felt like a sack of spuds the last, like, two weeks. I've done barely any exercise, diet's been crap, but Oh well, these things happen. Oh. Oh. Brilliant. Hey! <laughs> Fab! Look what she. Look at that sock! Oh my god. I'm exposing you. Nah. Nah. No, what is that? That's come straight out of Stig of the Dumps wardrobe. <laughs> His name's Kevin. Ellen, that is the worst. No, 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 no. He's even got a hole on the side. Is, is that for that... aerodynamics? That's all the work I've been putting in. So you've got to throw that in the bin. There is... And that one! <laughs> no, oh my God, they have seen some days, those are. Oh, you're not drinking that. No, no, no! No, please! No, I'll dump you. You won't, no. I will. It's my first one in like 10 days, Al. Same. Is it? Oh yeah, you've not been going either. Are you excited? Could go one way or the other, couldn't it? It's gonna go up. What, go up? Good. Good? Yes! <laughs> Can you give us your favourite, your your famous line from Fab and Al YouTube? <laughs> What do you think? The bagels! Yeah! <laughs> I got no drip in my pocket. Must have forgot it, or maybe I already lost it. Don't got enough to go cop it. I'm about to take off like a rocky. Houston, we might have a problem, but that don't mean money or solve. No, that don't mean money or solve.
Woke up dreaming of the commas And I got a hundred dollars in my wallet I've been trying to make it, do it for my mama I Ain't with the faking, never with the drama She said that I'm naked, now I gotta honor That replace a Honda with the fucking model I Replace my exes with a couple models She act out of pocket, now it's just a problem I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it No, really, don't worry I don't want no Burberry glowing like the sun Or maybe a little Mercury She been like I'm booking, but nobody ever heard of me They don't got five O's when I say word to me Nah, but really, really, y'all been acting silly I could care less if you fucking with me Cause I still got the chest coming 150 I got no drip in my pocket yeah. Back from the gym with the t-shirt stealer. This is my Gymshark summer party top that she's robbed. Does go well with the leggings though, to be fair. Shorts. Shorts. What are you cooking up? Pesto pasta. I swear I was cooking this in the last video. Were you? Mm -hmm. This is my favorite dinner oh of all time. Mm. Very good. Looks a bit weird in a bacon <laughs> bowl. It's because we haven't got anything big enough to like Mix it in. Yeah. I noticed you put a lot of chicken in there. Is there more chicken breast than usual? Yeah, because I'm going to have some for my lunch tomorrow. Look, it goes in the dish like that. Bit of cheese on top then, is it, Al? Mm -hmm. And then, is it under the grill? Yeah. For like 10 minutes? Yeah. And then it goes absolutely... Because I taught you how to, t to make this, didn't I? Mm, I can make it now. Yeah. The, was the one I made good? Yeah, it was really yummy actually. Someone commented the other day saying, is everything okay? Because I saw you've got red top milk in your fridge. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what, usually I do prefer green milk, but years ago is. when we started cutting, right, we got red milk because it's lower calorie. And fats. And fats. Um, we and we just, we just bought it ever since. Although it does taste like water. What the hell? What? That is you and your midnight snacking putting ham over the cheese. What? It's not. Is it about to come on? Big cup, big cup, big cup, big cup, big cup. This is like our thing to do, isn't it? We've done this our whole relationship. What? Watch Bake Off together. Yes, we have actually. All the time. Yes! Start your engines. Paul Hollywood, get your... <laughs> you can't say that on YouTube. <laughs> Ducks, rabbits, Frogs. high tops, <laughs> and mayonnaise by the tire. Come on, Al. Can you fill your donuts, donuts up with jam? jam? What? This is a tune. What is going on with this intro? Right, come on, then. Who do you think is going to win? Straight off the bat. Straight off the bat. She's gone first round. I reckon. <laughs> He's got the dub. He's got the dub out. What does the dub mean? The win. He's winning. Oh. He is. He's the winner. I bet you he wins. You think? Fifty quid. It's no, the tash. I, it's the tash. I, I... Little bit of a shift in the mood. Um, want to talk a little bit about mental health and how I've been feeling lately. Maybe Ellen can pitch in on how she's been feeling. We're always happy, smiley in our content, and that is what we're like. We always have a laugh. We always mess around, but. I think it's also really important to showcase that we do have shit times. And for me, the last month has been a bit of a shit time. Um, and I think it has for a lot of people really, but I just wanted to talk through like my, my experience, how I was feeling in the hope that maybe some of you can relate. Uh, it's not, I'm not looking for sympathy. I'm absolutely fine now. I've come out the other end of it but I think it could be useful to talk about it. So I went through a phase where I was questioning everything that I've loved for years. It's not Ellen. Yeah, <laughs> um, things like the gym, which I've always loved going to the gym and training. I just completely lost all motivation. Um, and I think that was due to being busy with work and other stuff, but I just didn't like training. I was going to the gym, not really enjoying it at all. So I kind of just stopped that. Also making videos is something I've done my whole life and I've always loved it. I do absolutely love it. But for about two weeks, I was like, do I really want to be making videos? Like questioning it basically. And now that I look back on it, it's really weird because I think I'll always be making videos for the rest of my life in some shape or form. But yeah, it was just a really confusing time. I had no drive to like get up. If you follow me on Instagram, you may have seen that going back a few months, we had like a really good routine getting up at five, which I've actually got back now. This week, we've been getting up at five because Elle's been back at school. But <laughs> so basically, yeah, it's basically Ellen. That, because I forget. Yeah, I got no choice. 
Um, but I lost all of that and I just had no drive to get up out of bed. And it's not like I was depressed or anything. I was just really confused and just like, yeah, I just felt weird. So I decided to sort of talk about it on Instagram, um, which actually made me feel a lot better. And it was nice to see that people were going through a similar thing. But someone actually DM me, a couple of people DM me and said about something going on with the moon. Now, I'm probably going to butcher this, right? I'm probably going to butcher this. I did do a bit of research into it. It's, I'll put it on the screen. Pisces, isn't it? No, it's every. It affects everyone. No, I think it's just it's Pisces. Retro, retrograde is called cool, or retrograde. Anyway, I'll put it on the screen or in the description so you can have a look. But it's something to do with like a cycle of the moon. Yeah, basically what's going on with the moon can like affect people. And everything that I read was like how I was feeling, which could be a complete coincidence. Mm. I don't actually know if it's scientifically proven or not, but it is weird though how it like. I th I believe it because I'm yeah. very much like a spiritual person. Um, I de I definitely believe in like the universe guiding you in certain directions and stuff like that. Um, and I def I do have a, actually got a crystal ball in yeah, there. Yeah, he's got so all his crystals laid out on the It's phone. £2.50 if you want your future read. Just go to the PayPal link in the description. Mm. I'm very open-minded. And yeah, I believe in all that kind of stuff. So if you've been feeling weird, have a look. Read up about it because it could well be that. Obviously, like that's not going to be the only reason. It's probably a bundle of things but if you're going through a similar thing you're feeling a bit weird questioning things or whatever it's completely normal to have stages like that and if you're a man men are shit at talking about how they feel luckily i'm quite i don't really like it doesn't bother me talking about this stuff and I, i've seen firsthand like the good that it can do i've experienced it myself um that talking about this sort of stuff talking to your mates your family or whatever it may be, does really help. I'm a very sensitive person, aren't I? Yes. Very yes. sensitive. Uh, <laughs> what star sign am I? Virgo. Yes. Are you? Yeah. Would you have Fiery. guessed that I was a Virgo? <laughs> Fiery. That's it for this week's video. Leave a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're new. We'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.